Bobby Driscoll was a child star who worked closely with Disney. He had a very successful career, including winning a junior Oscar at age 12, and one of his most notable roles was at the age of 16, where he was the voice and model for Walt Disney's Peter Pan. Unfortunately, after the production of Peter Pan concluded, Bobby started entering his awkward teenage years. One morning, he arrived to work, but they refused to let him onto the lot, telling him his contract had been terminated. The reason given was because he had acne and could no longer fit into the role of cute child star. This started a tragic downward spiral. He tried to continue acting, but fell into substance abuse. He ended up dying alone at age 31 in an abandoned New York apartment. When his body was discovered, he had no ID, so they buried him in a pauper's grave, and thanks to lost burial records, no one knows where it is. None of this was known until a year later, when Bobby's father was dying, so his mother asked Disney to find him so they could be reunited before that happened, only to discover that her son was already dead. 